And then Harold Marcus. It's tidy again, Eamon. Williams. O'Connor, Liverpool are starting to warm up here. And Blackburn had a good little spell, but Liverpool really starting to, to burn now. It's O'Connor's shot, which is deflected. It's a, a really important block by Decandia. Yeah, as you can see, Sonny Lambie, you know, makes the space for the, the winger to cut inside there. Uh, number eight, sorry. I think the referee will try and let the, the play flow a little bit more. Talent, he's done really well to get back in and win the ball back. Well, here comes on a new goal towards O'Connor again, who slides it across goal. It does get a touch on it from Mansbridge. Well, Liverpool will get themselves a corner. Williams will take the corner. And it's an important header away and a, an even better volley to, to send it further downfield. Tied it up by Lomeni. It's DJ Esdale. Lovely little strep away from the, the challenge of Boggan. Shorrocks with the challenge. Here's Boggan. Glamini makes the run. Again, he managed to get the strike away, but the cover from, from Lucas Pitt didn't really give him too much to aim at. No, that's what you see Estelle make that run forward. There's always that, you know, counter-attack opportunity for Blackburn. Wasn't a, much for Willis to work with there, and he, he could only give the ball away. On Anuga, that's oh. travelling. It wouldn't come round for him. You'll see that gap on the far side of the goal that was opening up nicely and he just didn't quite get the ball to, to fade a bit for him that's going to break for Boggan it's a lovely first touch well, the game pick comes across to make the challenge, but Boggan will see that as, as the best chance so far. To try playing the straight pass into midfield, it's sort of got intercepted, so good chance for Blackburn, just done enough. Williams, here comes O'Connor again. And Mansbridge did well, held him up. Good win as well by, by VAR. Boggan, lot to do. Support arriving now. That's really good defending from DJ Esdale. You can see DJ make that run from the start. Look how tired he is from that run, running all the way back there. The recovery run, you can see it from early on. Neiman can't keep that. And here's Boggan. Right at the start of the second half, there's pressure here for Liverpool. And Boggan's got a break. Now has he got the support? Or does he go for goal on himself? Support needed. It's Willis to Dlamini. He will have a go. It's a good block by Pitt. He's done well both times there, Pitt. I think the modern day, you know, as the defender now, you can see back in my day, I'd want to win the ball straight away. He's done really well delaying this to try and get some help back. He got the help back. And then he's over the other side. He's got that, you know, that danger in his head. Can I clear it? He's, he's aware. He can see it. Can he sense the danger? And Blackburn have a corner. 90 seconds into the second half. The goalkeeper is coming. It's actually taken by Inihara Max. And then put oh. back in. With the goalkeeper completely beaten. And it's turned home by Willis. And Blackburn Rovers have got themselves in front. They started the first half very, very quickly. They started the second the same. And they've been rewarded with a goal. Yeah, Lewis Marcus gets the first contact. I think the problem was with, with Hall. He's come out to to get the ball and couldn't get back in he's come out to collect he, if he'd have stayed he, he just comfortably collects this ball but it's you know it's a, it's a frustrating one to concede it's a lovely ball by Shorrock Mansbridge has made a really good run here Williams is getting across and Mansbridge will be annoyed because he had the the space and he had the the time to run into his touch maybe just a little heavy. Yeah, a little bit heavy. Gave us um, 
Cam Williams time to get back in there. They are going to go short to, to Patrick Farkas, the Blackburn captain here. It's going to come back to Willis. It's towards Davis, beyond him. It's towards De Candia. The second ball breaks. And in the end, it's, it's fired over the top, where it was half a chance for, for Farkas, who just wandered across the penalty area. I've been really impressed with Bailey Hall's distribution this morning. Sometimes under pressure, trying to trying to play. His long kicking's good. Oh, now that's a really good run by Boggan. Now this is his opportunity to double the advantage, and he's not able to do so. Again, Bailey Hall, and that Liverpool defence, when they've been called upon, have have stepped in to bail Liverpool out. Boggan's had two or three of those. This though, the best chance he's had. Yeah, the keeper does brilliant here, staying up so late. I mentioned the relationship between these two clubs and, uh, and the fact that Harvey Elliott, Tyler Morton, now Owen Beck have, have had such good loans there. Yeah, and at that age, it's so it's so vital. You do get out on loan when the time is right, and that's up to the, the coaching staff, you know, along with the agent and the player himself, knowing when that time's right. I talk, went, I think. Talk about decisions and plus a ball for Boggan, who's in this time. And once again, Bailey Hall comes across, steps out. That's a huge right hand. And the goalkeeper now is keeping Liverpool in this game. That's why it's two massive saves by Bailey Hall. He's got a really strong hand to that down right. Still an opportunity for Liverpool in this game if they can just get that goal because it will change everything if they can. Williams did well to uh, keep hold of that ball and, and keep it in play. It was absolutely rocketed. Oh, the goalkeeper's made a mess of that. Here's that chance for Bradshaw. It's a really good challenge by De Candia. Just the first touch taken away from the Liverpool substitute. But that's the sort of chance that Liverpool have been waiting for seemingly all game. Yeah, I don't think Bradshaw expects this. He's, we've won the ball back high. He's just got a open his first touch towards the goal and he can get his shot off here but it goes inside and here comes Engerholm running at Leeming beating Leeming the delivery just too high for Engerholm whose delivery comes in and on a new it was he just couldn't quite turn it home Bradshaw's effort in the end goes wide he's got the ball wide so direct this is what you love to see from your, your wingers that's a decent ball inside it won't break for Bradshaw and then the the balls are, it's a bit of a horrible one to hit for Schofield on many just never seemed to set for him the Blackburn defenders today, they've been really compact, made sure they've had balls. People in front of, you know, the goalkeeper blocking these shots, they've defended her well there. Lumeni. Great ball. It's a lovely ball. Bradshaw. And it's going to break towards Ahmed. And the challenge was another outstanding one. Again, it's Michael De Candia who gets across to deny Liverpool a level. Up. I think we, we could have had, you know, I've definitely deserved at least a goal. And um, we've been saved by, you know, Bailey Hall. Oh, way. Bailey Hall has lost it. And it's finished right at the end by Joseph Valentin, who ends the game and ends the contest with a, a simple goal as you could have. And Bailey Hall, who's been immaculate throughout and made save after save to keep Liverpool in it, caught in possession. Willis flew into the challenge and then there's one 
from Shorrocks as well. And there was a, a couple of challenges there that the referee wants to have a little word about. O'Connor with the delivery. Goalkeeper is coming, doesn't get there. Lucas Pitt coming around the back, but he can't do anything with it. And that's the, the last chance for Liverpool. A game that they put so much into. They trailed at the start of the second half to, to Shorrocks' header from a, a half-cleared corner. And then right at the end, as they chase the game, Bailey Hall caught in possession. And the second goal ended it as a contest when they'd put so much into it. They, they, they created chances, but ultimately they just couldn't couldn't take one. Liverpool under 18s nil, Blackburn Rovers under 18s two.